On Monday, I'm going to try solo 100 extremes in a day, <laughs> starting on um, one of the big crags called Scarfell. Mm. So I'll go up and camp on there on Sunday and then track back via a little crag called Piers Gill Crag to Flat Crags, Neck Band, over to Gimmer, Pavey, a couple of little crags between and then down Borrowdale basically and finish on Castle Rock. All going well, so I'll come here as well to Recastle. <laughs> I'll get up at 2.45 so I'm getting a reasonable night's sleep and then um, yeah, try and knock Central Butchers out uh, and then yeah, set off running from there. Yeah, I'm willing to um, I'm willing to do a fair few with a head torch if I have to but I'd, I'd kind of like to tank it through and uh, yeah, get down for last orders kind of scene. bit of a pie in the sky idea for probably 14 years ago I thought about it. Um, man, I was better at soloing then, but I'm much stronger now basically. <laughs> Although I've lost a lot of confidence, I know I can hang on harder. Um, uh, I try not to think very much, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, you know, most of the soloing is quite unconscious. A lot of the routes I've done here I've done before. Uh, but yeah, mainly concentrating on the climb and on just being relaxed. Yeah, move by move for sure. So just uh, concentrate on e each move. Uh, but the way I look at it is you're just doing tons and tons of awesome climbs. So you think when you go out and do three or four really good routes, that's like a good day, isn't it? And now imagine doing that times 20, 20 or 30 fold. <laughs> that's the way I look at it. And it's warm. <laughs> Very warm. Borrowdale Valley is the greenest valley. It's you know the most beautiful valley uh, I've seen, pretty much. Uh, and yeah, the climbing is fantastic. Very varied, generally on really good rock. Um, and yeah, that's what I like about the lakes. And it's where I was brought up as well. So quite close connections to the lakes. My dad used to give uh, talks in the Moot Hall in Keswick, and he used to give uh, walks and fells of Lakeland, Lakeland in winter, and. Um, climbing the Lakeland Fells or some such. <laughs> and I used to press the button. So yeah, and he built footpaths on a lot of these hills. So, and then I got taken out as a kid, so I know them pretty well. So yeah, here in Clamberis Pass feel like home to me. Hmm. <sighs> Sorry. Are oh, you all right? Look, look. It's great at finger flag, isn't it? Yeah. Tank up here. They've got the BMC ambassadors from lots of different aspects of climbing. So, you know, from competitions, obviously, Sean, uh, Molly Thompson Smith, and bouldering, uh, to kind of alpine stuff like Callum, uh, you know, super hard sports stuff like Steve, uh, and, you know, more kind of hard comps from Fran. Uh, and then I suppose I cover the, the soloing and the, the trad stuff. The idea of the scheme is to help. I try and help promote uh, the BMC to, um, yeah, to more members and help out at some of the events as well. You know, by giving talks, helping out on coaching workshop and instructing stuff. Uh, yeah, that's kind of the main main deal. 
mega hold this thing with you right. Mega horn. Hmm. Classic little route.